This is Deng Forest, located between Goska and Gidanwaya communities, both in Jema, local government area of southern Kaduna. It's the area surrounding the farms of the residents, and they say they've not been able to go to the farm since the December 24, 2016 attacks, as they claim armed herdsmen have taken over their farms. I'm appealing to the government to please help to assign police and the, the soldiers to go inside the forest and drive them out. Because our lads, we don't have any strength to go. We, are, we don't have any means to go there as of now. Responding to the fears of the people, the this Chief of true, Army Staff, Lieutenant General uh, Tukoboratai, promises a swift action. We have our special forces who are well trained uh, to go into any terrain and uh, operate. So be rest assured. Uh, we will do uh, the right thing. But overall, the people say they want sincere dialogue for peace. So reconciliation, there must be honesty. There must be honesty and we must do everything to see that we protect our promise. So that when I say, you know, I will not fight, I will not kill you, that I won't, I won't kill you, I won't, I, I, won't, I won't injure you. The governor, Nasir El Rafai, promises to take the effort beyond just dialogue and to be objective. We do not care what ethnic group or religion he is. Frankly, I do not even care if he's my son or daughter. If he participates in this crisis, we will face a judge. If the judge says he has done nothing wrong, so be it. But my duty, which I swore with the Quran, is to ensure that we enforce the law and we'll do it. At any cost, at any price. The people of Southern Kaduna say they are holding the government to its promises.